So hi again. Many events, phenomena are modeled as systems of linear equations. Systems of equation can be transformed into matrices and matrices are very important to the data world. In module one, you will learn the different types of systems of equation and how the different properties and operations of matrices can be used to solve them. At the end of each week, you will be applying the methods you have learned by solving real life problems, both analytically and using MATLAB. Module one will be taken for four weeks. Week one is about solving systems of equation using an algorithm called Gaussian and Gauss-Jordan elimination. You will also learn to construct systems of linear equation by modeling real life problems such as in various types of networks. This reinforces your knowledge and understanding of concept and harness your problem-solving skills. At the end of week one, you will be given an assessment task, uh, particularly exercise 1.1, which allow you to um, assess your understanding on the concepts discussed in week one. In week two, the concept of matrices, types, properties, and matrix algebra will be discussed. And in this section, you will express a system of equation as a matrix product and apply a technique called matrix inversion in finding its solution. You will be encountering terms such as singular, invertible, and elementary matrices. And at the end of the lesson, you are expected to apply the concept of matrix inversion in solving systems of linear equation, as well as in, in cryptography and other real life application. Again, do not forget to do exercise 1.2 which allows you to have a self-check on your understanding of the uh, topics discussed in week two. In week three, uh, this is all about determinants and its properties and application. In this section, you will learn to use the cofactor expansion method in evaluating the determinant of a matrix. Consequently, you will be using this technique in uh, finding the adjoint of a matrix which you can use to find the inverse of a matrix. You will also learn another method in solving systems of equation using Kramer's rule. At the end of week three, you should also be able to uh, determine whether matrices are singular and non-singular and by applying your knowledge on determinants and also apply these concepts and techniques in solving real life problems. At the end of week three, you should be able to uh, finish your exercise 1.3 uh, to do a self-check on your understanding of the topics discussed. Finally, week four will be an assessment, assessment week uh, wherein you will have your first long examination and also you will be given a MATLAB activity which allows you to uh, solve the problems in uh, linear algebra, particularly in uh, matrix operations, matrix algebra, and um, as well as a Gaussian and Gauss-Jordan elimination using the commands available in MATLAB. Uh, 